When I jump off the platform, it feels like I'm flying. It's quite scary, but when you go for it, it's actually quite fun. Initially, it's quite scary, but you get this kind of thrill when you go. I feel quite nervous, depending on what dive it is, but like I know that it's not too bad once I've done it. I need wrist guards because from constant impacts from going about 10 metres high builds up issues of your wrist. You'll have to stop in the future if they get too bad. And without wrist guards, it just makes it 10 times worse. For a lot of the, the younger divers that go up on the platforms, the wrist injuries are quite frequent. It's good to have protection at a young age. They help my wrists because my wrists are pretty weak. When I dive on 7 metre, it really hurts my wrists to go into the water. I get worried watching my daughter dive every single training session. There's accidents, it happens. It's even just going up off the diving board over and over again. It's something that can take fantastic divers out of competitive channels just because it can impact on their growth plates. They have to do those things to get to the end result. Especially with the young athletes going higher up on those boards, it's nice to feel that they're supported and that there's not going to be any risk. So I would definitely recommend it for a lot of the clubs out there. I have used one other type of wrist guard, but they were too bulky on my wrist. They just felt too wrong diving, so I just stuck with tape. The scaled wrist guards are very good. They're very supportive compared to other wrist guards. Better to like move, like because if it's just like a solid piece of like foam or something, it doesn't move as much. I like it. It's pretty comfortable right now. I haven't worn wrist guards before, but they feel really good. They're very nice. They're a lot less bulky, and they're really comfortable. They look quite nice and they feel nice and soft inside so they don't hurt your hands. I really like these ones, protect your wrists and they're quite flexible so you can still do everything. I like the design of like the skills here. The design is nice, I think before we've had quite a standard design and I think this looks a little bit more trendy, a little bit more cool. My role model is Grace Freed. Peter Waterfield. Andrea Spendalini Syria. Jack Law. It's Jack Law. Obviously my coach Matt and probably Jack Law as well. My big dream is to die for Scotland. To go to the Olympics. Going to the Olympics. To be an Olympian. Going to the Olympics. I'd like to compete for Scotland. I want to become a really good diver. My biggest motivation is making my parents proud. To never give up and to like keep chasing your dream.